Hey, what's going on guys? Today I'm going to show you all how to get Fortnite Mobile with GeForce Now on iOS and Android instantly guys. So you're not going to have to like wait to download it and join the waitlist or the beta. You're going to be able to actually play Fortnite Mobile after following my steps in this tutorial. As you can see, I do have Fortnite Mobile installed. I didn't get it from the App Store. I did get it from the GeForce Now app that I'm going to show you guys actually how to download. But this is the modded version and it allows you to download Fortnite Mobile right away without having to wait on the beta, like waitlist or whatever. And this method also works for Android, so follow along with me guys. And uh, yeah, and the Fortnite Mobile will be the latest updated like version, so you know you get uh, what's currently out right now on like all the other platforms, which is Chapter 3, uh, Season 1 as of now. Although Season 2 is going to be coming out very shortly. But yeah, it will automatically update to that. So it's brand new guys, everything is like, like new. And yeah, so let's get into it guys. I'm gonna show you right now how to do this. It's very, very simple. Leave a like on the video, subscribe, and now I'm gonna show you guys how to do this. All right guys, so the way this method works is, like I said, we're gonna have to download GeForce now, but um, this is actually uh, a modded version of it. So what I mean by that is when you open it up, it's gonna say like Fortnite limited time closed beta for mobile on GeForce now. Play Fortnite on iOS, Safari, and Android devices, but, if you guys try to do this normally, there will be like a waitlist and you'll have to join it. And you might think, oh, it's just, I just gotta wait a little bit. No guys, trust me, this waitlist takes forever. I've tried it before, like legitly, and it literally took like two, three weeks before I was able to start playing. Sometimes I even heard people saying they've been waiting for like over a month now and they still haven't been able to play. But with this method, there is a button that says skip waitlist. And when you tap that, it would automatically bypass the waitlist and you'll be able to go ahead and play Fortnite Mobile on your iOS or Android device, guys. So very, very simple. As you can see, you know, it's Fortnite right there. It says Fortnite, but it's actually Fortnite Mobile. And um, yeah. And the game itself is actually not that big of a file because it's hosted in the cloud servers on GeForce Now. But it runs perfectly smooth, nice frames too, and it's not laggy, so it's a very good experience on mobile. But uh, yeah, guys, I'm gonna go ahead now and show you how to actually download this GeForce Now app onto your iOS and Android phones. So the first thing that we have to do guys is we just got to make sure that our device is compatible for the download. So to do this, we have to change some settings on our iOS and Android devices. So if you guys are on iOS, open up your settings app and uh, what you're going to want to do is scroll down until you see battery. So as you guys can see battery is right there. We're going to go ahead and select it and then you'll see low power mode, right? You're just going to want to make sure that you guys have this turned off. So boom, we have it off. Then once you've done that, exit out of battery, but now scroll up to general. And then in general, you will see background app refresh. Select it. Select it here in the top. And all you guys will have to do is just make sure that this is turned on to either Wi-Fi or Wi-Fi and cellular data. Either one is fine, but just make sure that this is not off guys and you should be good. And then once you've done that, you're gonna wanna exit out of here and then stay in general still, but now scroll up. You're gonna see where it says about, right? Just select it. And then you'll see software version. Just go ahead and make sure that you're running iOS 10 and above on your iOS device, guys. And uh, once you've done that, it's gonna be perfect. And that is going to be all the settings that we have to change on iOS phones. Um, now, if you guys are on an Android, we also have to change some settings really quick. So let me go ahead and show you all what, um, you know what we have to change on Android so open up your settings app on your Android phone guys and um, find like the search bar or like where it says search settings tap on it and what you guys are gonna want to do is type in the word unknown so to spell that it's U N K N O W N so make sure you guys spell this correctly but go ahead now and tap on it or I mean type it in and once you type it in you should see something that says install unknown apps or something similar to that. So go ahead and select it. And then what you guys are gonna wanna do is um, find the, uh, it's gonna pull up like a list of apps on your Android and you're just gonna wanna find the uh, browser that you use on your Android. So I'm gonna go ahead and select Google Chrome. But uh, you know, whatever browser you guys use, you select it. So I'll select Google Chrome. And then there's going to be an option that says allow from this source. And you just gotta make sure that this is enabled so pretty simple just make sure that this is enabled guys and uh you'll be good to go but that's going to be the only setting that we have to change on android now if you guys are on ios i mean uh 
Now that we've changed all those settings, we are now ready to download the GeForce Now++ Plus Plus app to go ahead and start playing Fortnite Mobile. Um, so guys, let's get into it. First, I'm going to show you how to download this app on iOS, and then I'll show you guys how to download it on Android because the uh, download process is slightly different. But if you guys are on iOS, open up your browser and go to yulustore.com. So once again, that's yulustore.com, guys. And what you're going to want to do is go to the search bar and type in uh, GeForce Now. So there you have it, GeForce Now++. Plus plus. Go ahead now and tap the install button. And now we just got to wait a little bit for this to load. Uh, and then I'll show you guys how to download the app. I mean, how to download the GeForce Now++ Plus Plus on Android devices after I finish installing it here on my iOS device. And it's loading now. All right, so it's gonna see this website is trying to download a configuration profile. Do you wanna allow this? Tap the allow button. Profile downloaded, when you see that, tap close. Exit out and now open up your settings. And then you guys will scroll down and select um, general. Scroll down again and select profiles and device management. Then you'll see GeForce Now++ plus plus right here at the top, guys. Just select it and then tap the install button. Uh, if you have a passcode, it will make you enter it in. Tap next, tap install, tap install, and then go ahead and tap done. And boom, guys, GeForce Now++ plus plus is now on our iOS device, just like that. Now, if you guys are on Android, I'm going to show you right now uh, how to download the app on Android. So go ahead and open up your you know browser on your Android device, guys. And go to the exact same website, so yulustore.com. You're going to come here and then go ahead and type in GeForce Now, and you will see it, GeForce Now++. Plus Plus. Tap Install. And now we just have to wait a little bit for this to load. Go ahead and give it a couple more seconds. And should start loading. Let's see here. All right, so it's gonna say download the file, tap download. Then it will say file downloaded, tap open. There we have it, GeForce Now++. Plus Plus. Do you wanna install this? Tap install to confirm it. And as you can see, it is installing. And it's taking a little bit of time. All right, there we go. App installed. Once you see that, tab done. And when we exit out, guys, um, boom, GeForce Now++ Plus Plus is on our Android device. So that's going to be it. Now all you guys will have to do is open it up, skip the wait list, and then you'll be able to download Fortnite Mobile. So if you guys have questions, let me know down below and enjoy playing Fortnite Mobile in 2022, guys. Peace out.